Hello everyone, welcome to our new video. In this video, we will show you how to set up LinkedIn inside Tag using Google Tag Manager. So if you want to set up a uh, LinkedIn uh, conversion tracking using Google Tag Manager, then you can consider watching this video. Okay, so without any further delay, let's get started. So we'll be setting up LinkedIn conversion tracking uh, or we'll be setting up LinkedIn inside tag for this website okay and you can see over here I have already set up a Google Tag Manager account for this website so for checking whether Tag Manager has been installed on this website or not I'm gonna take the help of an extension called Tag Assistant Legacy and I'm gonna refresh the page then if I click on it then you can see over here google tag manager gtm kw and last digit ng so gtm kw ng okay so tag manager has been uh, implemented for this website properly so for setting up linkedin inside tag i have come to my linkedin account okay then we'll click on this uh, option called advertise okay so i'm gonna click on it then it will be redirected you to the linkedin campaign manager okay so here you can see in facebook we called it business manager but in linkedin we called it a uh, campaign manager so you can see over here i have two uh, campaign manager account over here uh, this one and this one so i'm going to be choosing this one then you can see over here we have campaign group then campaigns and ads okay so campaign go groups are like uh, are likely uh, ad group then campaigns and ads okay perfect then uh, i have created uh i have created a campaign group okay with the name of analytical growth ad group i have named it like this so you can name it as per your requirements okay so if you don't know how to create it, then you uh, you can click on this create option, then uh, you'll be easily able to create this ad group, okay, or campaign group, I should say. So I'm gonna click on uh, this campaign group, okay, perfect. Then you can see we have an option called uh, analyze okay so i'm gonna click on it and uh inside analyze i have an option called sources so for setting up linkedin inside tag i'll click on sources and you can see over here uh no recent activity so this is the inside tag so i'm gonna click on it then if i scroll down then you can see we have a uh, couple of options available here like you can choose how to insert or how to install your tag so you can uh, do it manually i'll install the tag myself or you can send the code to a developer or you can use google tag manager so in this video we'll be uh, using uh, google tag manager but if you want to uh, set up it manually then what you need to do you need to copy this code and if you go to the tag manager and then new then in the custom html section if you paste it okay and if you trigger it all pages then you can do it using this option okay uh you can name it linkedin i'm gonna click on save so this is the manual way so let's uh see whether the manual uh OS works or not so i'm gonna click on preview section and i need to provide the website then i'll click on connect so tag assistant connected so you can see over here linkedin inside tag has fired on time so this is the manual process you can do it using custom html okay but uh you can either use this option or you can use now uh, you can use uh 
template actually they have a built-in template called linkedin insight 2.0 so we'll be showing you using the uh, linkedin insight tag but you can use this option as well so for using google tag manager i'll click on this option okay so you can see over here they are giving us a partner id okay so i'll go to the google tag manager first of all we need to go to the template section because we are going to be using a template for inserting or installing a linkedin insight tag okay perfect just wait a little bit it might take some while Okay, I'm going to search on LinkedIn Insight. Insight. So you can see over here, LinkedIn Insight 2.0. So I'm going to click on it. I'm going to click on Add to Workspace. And I'll click on Add. And I'll go to the Tag section. I'm going to click on New. And I'll name the tag as LinkedIn. Okay. I'm going to be choosing Tag Configuration as linkedin insight 2.0 then you can see we have an option called partner id or insight tag id so i'm gonna go to uh this data source section and i'll copy this code and paste it over here okay perfect so we don't need to do anything else other than this one okay and from the triggering section i'll trigger it as all pages and i'm gonna click on save so LinkedIn inside uh, tag has been uh, set up. So let's uh, test whether it is working or not. So for testing, I'm going to go to the preview section. I'll copy the website URL. It has already been copied. So I'm going to be uh, clicking on connect button. see over here tag assistant connected let's go to the tag assistant uh preview mode okay so you can see over here linkedin inside tag has fired one time that means uh it is working properly so this is how you can uh set up uh linkedin inside tag uh either using custom html or using uh, uh their uh template called linkedin insight 2.0 so yeah uh that's it for this video hopefully you have liked our video if you like our video then you can consider subscribing our channel following our page you have a good day bye bye